Got all stars? We do. All of the lights. Of course we do. It's Hollywood, the city of angels. And with all of those lights, the question would be which all star would shine bright? Friday night, the T Mobile Rookie Challenge belonged to a pair of former college teammates. Washington point guard John Wall and Sacramento big man DeMarcus Cousins led the rookies to a 148-140 win over the sophomores. Wall racked up a record 22 assists, and his former Kentucky teammate had 33 points, holding off OKC's James Harden and San Antonio's DeWan Blair, who finished with 28 in defeat. It's, it's amazing. Just for me being here, being uh, second year, uh, great game. Lost, but at the same time, I had a lot of fun with, 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 with everybody out there. No one could have expected so much so quickly from New York rookie Landry Fields, but the steal of the NBA draft who started Friday night was as integral a part of the win as he has been to the Knicks' success this winter. The California product came home and scored 15 points in the victory. In L.A. with, uh, with my family and friends here, uh, really something special to me. The only rookie with better credentials this season would be LA Clipper forward Blake Griffin. Griffin was on the move, driving home the point in the dunk comp and DeRozan. JaVale McGee and his mom couldn't slow him down. The Blake show went prime time. Well, it's cool, you know. It's, uh, like I said, you know, something I, I watched growing up, so to be a part of it and actually to be able to win it, uh, you know, it's, it's really cool. It was an historic weekend for the New York Knicks, who are alive and well. Landry Fields provided the appetizer, and then Amari Stoudemire was the main course in the finale. Amari became the first Nick to start an All-Star game since Patrick Ewing in 1992, and he certainly didn't disappoint. To be here in the All-Star game is a, a definitely a great reward, but it's, it's a team reward because without great success as a team, uh, this wouldn't be possible. Basketball is back in New York. The All-Star weekend wouldn't be complete without some Bronx flavor. BX born and raised Curtis Stinson starred in the D-League All-Star game. The Iowa Energy point guard dropped seven assists as his East squad defeated the West 115-108. New York and the East Coast and Bronx and everything, all that basketball, the East Coast is back, man. We back and you see a lot of guys at college from the East Coast doing their thing and we out here trying to represent. So it's all love, you know, we, we trying to show that we still got it, yeah, we still got it. Still, it's a star-driven league and no player seems to shine brighter on the big stage than LA's Kobe Bryant. The Black Mamba stung the East to the tune of 37 points and 14 rebounds as the West topped their counterparts 148-143. Bryant secured his fourth All-Star MVP award. He joins NBA legend Bob Pettit for the most in All-Star history. OKC's Russell Westbrook, a California native who started UCLA before joining the league, had 12 points in the West's victory. He, like Minnesota's Kevin Love, said there's something about being an All-Star. It's a great feeling, man. Like, you know, I'm blessed. I'm just here just trying to know these guys and and enjoy the feeling. You're feeling great all weekend. That's what it's all about. Putting a smile on your face and you know enjoying All Star Weekend. I mean, this is a lot of fun. This is what you're. Uh, this is what you dream about when you're a little kid. And you know, you can't wipe the, wipe the smile off my face this weekend. For Orlando's Dwight Howard and the East, there's always next year. The lights of All Star Weekend will follow them to Disney World. We're gonna have a lot of fun next year. Uh, it's, it's gonna be in Orlando, so uh, I'm gonna make sure that, uh, the city's ready. And we're going to do whatever we can to get uh, all the fans involved and everybody watching around the world. And we're going to put on a great show. As for ASG 2011, lights out LA.